what are the dangers around SSPL or as I like to call it half-assed open source uh, licenses? Like what, what do you see as the, the, the big drawbacks and the dangers, you know, as we go forward? Well, uh, I think it's uh, interesting to look uh, at, uh, at a few uh, groups, right, out there. So first, uh, there is this kind of claim Oh, you know what, if you are just using this software, you can still continue um, uh, using that uh, for free, right? But this is kind of really not what uh, open source is about, right? You can also say, hey, you know what? Uh, you can uh, use Facebook for free, right? Twitter for free, or, you know, hundreds of apps on your mobile phone for free, and it's uh, as good as uh, open source. Well, we all know, uh, right, especially if some, uh, recent scandals, right? It's uh, not uh, quite uh, uh, how things uh, uh, that work out, right? And uh, uh, and uh, uh, so there. So I would say is there is a lot of uh, additional value in the open source beyond free as in uh, free as in beer, right? So what does SSPL means for you if you are want to just uh, use software first? Uh, then we start speaking about the using uh, the da uh, databases, right? The database as a service is uh, the only model which is really valued by um, investor. And that is for a good reason because that is a model which is uh, really likely to dominate in the future for user, right? So if you want to use the, your favorite database in database as a service model, what are your choices, right? And folks who push SSPL for you, they want to say, hey, the only valuable way, the only way which will make sense in the future to deploy and use a database, database as a service, we want to be monopoly. We want to have monopoly for that, right? And uh, uh, right, and be the next Oracle. Well, if you've been Oracle customer, you know what it is to be Oracle customer, right? And chances are you don't want that to happen uh, to you again, right? In the normal open source, there is a, a, a competition, right? And the competition drives innovation. It has more balanced relationship between uh, uh, vendors uh, and customers, right? And uh, get a lot of uh, uh, great stuff for customers and for university at large, well, not so much uh, maybe for the company shareholders, right? I mean, uh, because uh, monopoly is a great, is the best way uh, uh, for business, right? If you are that monopoly. 